Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Jessica and this is Cliff. Today I am sharing my seventh month gray hair transition photos with you. By my seventh month, my confidence had gone way up. I started to wear more brightly colored clothing, which I had not worn very much of in the past, mostly because I did not want to bring any attention to myself. I had gained a lot of confidence thanks to my hair. I was nearing my haircut day where I would be getting a long pixie. I had the haircut chosen out, so I was really excited about that. I kept a copy of my inspiration haircut on my phone and computer to keep me motivated during the rough days. Here are the photos before my haircut. By the end of my sixth month and beginning of my seventh month, I had no doubt that this bright white was my natural hair color. There was a lot of growth and there was a lot of white hair that was hidden beneath the dyed part. So when I pulled my hair back, you could see that it was mostly just the ponytail area that was dyed, but the top area was completely white. So I had plenty of growth for a nice short haircut to where I can get rid of a lot of the dye. So here are my photos of my hair after I got the big chop. The before photo was taken a few minutes before my haircut appointment. I was in complete shock when I looked in the mirror and saw the transformation. My hair looked so different. I had a lot of new hair growth, so it blended in perfectly with my new haircut. After about one and a half to two weeks, my hair settled and I was able to style it to my liking. I decided to part the front a little different than my inspiration photo. If you look closely, you can see a little bit of the dye on the ends, but it really didn't bother me at all. I was just happy to get rid of most of the dye. Embrace the journey, embrace your gray, and just enjoy this whole process. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.